Once upon a time, Christmas was very different than it is today. Toys were simpler, candy was not as sweet, and there were two Santas living at the North Pole. There was White Santa, and there was Red Santa. They were the best of friends. All year long, they would make toys together at the North Pole. The only time they were ever apart was on Christmas Eve, when they delivered presents in separate sleighs. Those were very happy days indeed. However, everything changed one day when Red Santa found a book. A book called The Communist Manifesto. Red Santa stopped making toys. He became obsessed with reading this book over and over again. White Santa begged him to help with the toy making. Red Santa refused. Red Santa began to question the morality of delivering presents. White Santa tried to convince Red Santa that Christmas was good and children deserve presents. Red Santa had made up his mind. Red Santa had stopped believing in Christmas. When it came time to deliver presents that year, Red Santa had disappeared, never to be seen again. Until now. time. I should have known you were behind this. There's no need to be hostile, comrade. What have you done with my list? It's safe, I assure you. Why are you such a jerk? Why can't you enjoy Christmas like everyone else? Because I hate Christmas. I hate everything it stands for. It's a vile holiday that makes me sick to my stomach. Stealing Christmas is easy, brother. The second part of my deliciously wicked plan, now that's difficult. What do you mean, second part? You've already ruined Christmas. Isn't that enough? The children, Santa. I'm going to steal them all and bring them here to my fortress. That's impossible. The military will surely stop you. The military? Stop me? Don't make me laugh. Not even the mightiest army in the world is a match for what I have in store. Behold, the machine that will harvest the world's children. Look at it. Isn't it gorgeous? The children will be brought back to my secret lair and sorted out using your very list. The good children will be turned into my slaves. While the bad children will become soldiers in my army that will one day rule the world. You must be stopped. I'd like to see you try. But enough of this jibber-jabber. Goodbye, brother. I'll see you when I rule the world. Probably around Easter sometime. Hey Santa, this is rather unexpected. Shouldn't you be out delivering presents right about now? Yes, but my list of children has been stolen. What? By who? My evil brother! Oh man, evil twins are the worst. Did I ever tell you about the time my evil twin tried to take over high voltage? It was the night before our 10th anniversary. There's no time for stories! We need to get that list back before midnight! Right, where does this jerk live? The South Pole! I should have known. To the flying machine! Okay, Red. We know you're in there. You must have the wrong address. Red Santa lives very far away from here. Give us the list. What list? If you give us the list now, we'll let you keep your robot. I know nothing about these robots you speak of. Give us the list. Give me the list. You have the list. Why would I ask for it if I haven't? I'm giving you one more chance. I'm giving you one more chance. How about that? Give us the list! Oh, 
All right, let's show this guy what we're made of. No match for my superior kung fu. Christmas. No jumping. You're cheating. Give us the list. Awesome. Perfect. allowed to do that. And with the destruction of the evil Red Santa, Christmas was finally safe. That is, until next year. <laughs>